Um, before we begin, uh, in light of the fact that we are here in a, in a temple, I'd like to take a moment of silence uh, to remember the Spanish and his great contribution uh, to the city of Philadelphia and beyond. Good morning. I call the sunshine meeting of February 10th to order. Uh, we'll begin uh, with any public comment. Hearing none, we will proceed to the report from the secretary for email public comment. In order, the word of public comment. Thank you. We will now proceed to old business with a report from Executive Director of Silverman. Good morning. Good morning, Commissioners. Good morning, Jeff. Uh, Sunshine report for February 10th, data in imaging. To date, the imaging unit has processed 22,550 electronic applications. They're up to the as of yesterday, they were up to January 27th. Uh, the data unit has entered 4,500 paper applications and are up to date. So far, there were 4,600 deceased, deceased voters removed from the files. 71,481 people who have been inactive and failed to vote in the last two federal elections have had their status changed to cancel. 9,800 five-year five notices were mailed two weeks ago and the status of those voters have been changed to inactive, although they are still eligible to vote if they're marked inactive. We will still we, we will start mailing out voter ID cards on February 12th. Currently, the data unit is proofing, proofreading and making corrections on process applications. The election board is working on a calendar for the seminar classes. We have confirmed eight places that will host us for the in-person training. There will also be a virtual training like we had in the general election. The in-person classes will be the same as the general with only 20 people at a time without the class. Mask and social distancing will be enforced. The polling place unit election activities, both units have been working together, cleaning up from the general election and preparing for the upcoming primary. County Board of Elections nomination petitions have been available since yesterday for the Democrat, Democratic and Republican nominations, or nominations for the Office of District Attorney, City, City Controller, Judge of Elections, and Inspector of Elections. Information pertaining to the nomination petitions are on the front page of our website at PhiladelphiaVotes.com. Nomination petitions are available both on our website or in City Hall, Room 142. Starting February 16th, the south gates of City Hall, across from the Ritz Carlton Hotel, will be open Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. for petition-related services. As in the past, blank petitions are not available. All petitions must be created using the petition creation form. Staff is available to assist those who need it. This will ensure accuracy of the candidate database. Nomination petition can be circulated on February 16th at the earliest. Nomination petitions must be filed with the city, with the city hall with, at City Hall Room 142 no later than March 9th at 5 p.m. We are currently accepting absentee or mail-in ballot applications online at votespa.com or by paper application. And that's it. As far as the warehouse goes, the warehouse is still doing what they do. They're cleaning out the machines, prepping them, get them ready for uh, when we start doing the battle. Right. And that's it. That's all I have. Thank you, Joe. Thank you. Thanks, I just have one question for you. Sure. In regards to the petitions, yes. the uh, people that run for the election board, is it the same process? What's that? So the people that run for election board, is it the same process? It's the same process as what I read off. So they, they can actually download the forms as we're starting yesterday to download them. Um, but they can't go to the city hall until the 16th. Until they, they, they pick them up. All right. 
So. Thank you, Joe. Any new business? Uh, Funding manager. Uh, I know we talked about Coach Chaney in relation to Kentucky, uh, but he actually won the state championship at Chaney University, which I'm proud of. I'm not, you know, uh, you know, John Chaney's experience is uh, you know, quite a long experience. I mentioned that one, like I said, Division II uh, Championship, the Champion Division II. Thank you. Hearing no new business, I make a motion to adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Meeting is adjourned. We call the chair. Thank you.